happy, happy snow day, my little niblets. Today I'm just going to do a bead it embroidery kit that I got at the dollar store like three years ago. But, you know, we'll try it. See what it's like. So it comes with a cute little box. And it shows you a little picture. This one's a unicorn. Not sponsored, of course. And if you want some more ideas, go to craft.com. And they got plenty there. So... Let's slide this bad boy out because I know it's a, it's like those diamond paintings that you can get. So we'll see what we got. Let's see here. Oh, she's cute. Look at that. So you get your paper. And alongside here it has the colors and the numbers so that it goes along with each piece. Alright, now we get a little... A little gel that's going to help to pick up our little beads, our pen, little bead holder, and a little bag of beads. Alright, and then of course the instructions are on the back. So, right there somewhere. Or you just do it by picture. Put the glue on. Pick up your beads, stick it to the colors, you know, sort them out. Okay, so let's sort some of these bad boys over. Let's see what we can get. I'm going to try to do this upside down, so we'll go with you guys. So, obviously pink is the big color, so let's start with the H. The H is yellow. So, this bad boy open. Keep my bag so I can put that all back in after. Since it's cold in the house here, I'm going to rub this a little bit just to get it warm. It's like two pieces of plastic, but there's like a little bit of glue in there or gel, whatever it's called. And then I'll that one up. These are tiny. Holy tiny. Okay, so let's see if we can find the yellow. Oh, cool. They're even on each bag. There's like the letters right there. So, what I'm looking for is H. So, I got C, J. G, A, oh, is that H? H. Alright, so, let's get this together. Oof, these are tiny. Let's put those to the side for now. And then open up this bad boy. Careful when you open it. There. There we go. There. H. Da 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 da. There. Then it says to take your beads. So I'm guessing. going to somehow turn these so they're upright. Yes, I got my earphones in, so if I'm humming away, don't mind me. Holy, just trying to get these flat ends going to be a charge. So this is going to be a timely process, of course. So 
so get all these in there. Yeah, got most of them flat. I'm going to stick them on the H. Okay. Okay, so, oh my gosh, I don't know what your snow is like, but my snow is pretty bad out there. I can't even see out my window. Okay, so there, we got most of it. So, put this guy there for now. Let me peel off the cover so it shows off the yellow, but I'm going to go down from this corner. Actually, I'll start from here. I'm not pulling this corner thing off because I don't want it totally off, so I keep some of it. Because this might be one of those videos that's going to take a really long time to do. So, what I'm going to do, apparently you take your stick, give yourself some glue. Does that work or how did that work? It says push in. Get some gel. Okay. Gel. And then you pick up a diamond. And, oop, and you place it. Boop, boop, boop. Do, do, do. Oh, I think the gel helps to give it that glitter glow. And then you just try to get them right in the little boxes. There, see, get the little gel in there. And then tap each. <laughs> Definitely need some light. And you also need lots of the gel. Okay, so I think okay. I guess so when you put the gel in, just scoop it. Okay. Now oh this is going to be very, very, very time consuming. Yeah, like I said, just take the paper, but don't totally fold it back and start with the corner. I might put this back in the bag and start with the pink and work my way down. Ah, where are you going? No. Stay right there. Ba, ba, ba. I think that's why it's made too with the corner here like this, so you can put the stuff back in the bag. Do 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 Oh, this is so, I like this. This is fun. A little time consuming. So, does anybody want to talk? I think this is something I might do on a live video, because then I can kind of poke this a little bit at it, chat with you guys. I get one more H. Give me an H. Oh, so pretty. He's so pretty. Okay. Wait for too long, don't make a time copy for your head. All right, I'm going to do some more of this yellow, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're down to our last little bit of yellow. One, two, three, four, five, six. We've got six more blocks to do. 
And then I'm going to start with the pink and work from the corner over. So look for part two of this video. I'll come back and show you the progress. Because I honestly don't know how long this is going to take me. But it might be easier to start from the corner out. Because then I can just go right quick and not worry about all. Ah! No! Okay, be careful when you press because sometimes it sticks to the can, obviously. Delicious. So cries out. Great of the sun. Alright, three, two, and one. Okay, did we get all the yellows? There. Okay, so we got all the H's. All the yellows are done. So we're going to put this sheet back over, make sure it's nice and tight down. I don't want too much air getting in. And then we're going to put the yellow back in. Start with the pink. I don't know if you can tell. That's so pretty. Glitters. Alright, stay tuned for part two of... When it's almost done, we'll come back and finish it together. So I'm going to continue on with this beautiful little girl. And we'll think of a name for her. All right, my lovely little niblets. I'll catch you later in the next one. Love you all. Bye.